wheels already turning, the anxiousness to get into the kitchens to get started. I finally get to feel the pressure of the judges, uh, the pressure of, of, of planning and preparing. When the chef said go, my legs are shaking and trembling, but you just gotta realize you gotta focus the whole time and come up with a game plan with the teammates. Rolling out some pasta here, making our raviolis. It's coming together nicely and I think it's gonna go well. We have seen choosing puff pastry, making little puff pastry stuffed hors d'oeuvres, stuffed wonton. I have a student making fresh pasta, which is amazing because that shows skill which they've learned in the program uh, through our pantry class. So they're stepping way outside of the box, getting very creative and taking a big risk. Having a culinary education to learn the basics, the, the fundamentals of cooking is a very important start for students of any age. You're going to get that here at the school. The vinaigrette probably had a bit too much lemon in it, so I'm about to tweak it now. Trina, try it down. Good. Now's when it really gets exciting because they've been planning, they've been thinking, but the pressure of, oh man, we're out of time, is coming down, and that's where you really have to focus and have a plan. We got lots of explosive flavors coming out of our food. I believe we made something that I can actually be proud of, so I'm feeling pretty good. We got some really delicious sauces coming together to top our uh, top our wontons with. It is that work under pressure is where a lot of our creativity really comes forth. So far, I've had about six things, and uh, yeah, these students are bringing it today. what they wanted to do, but they still left open the uh, idea of experimenting a little bit, you know, thinking outside of the box a little bit, and you know, that kind of thinking kind of pushed them ahead to be, uh, to be number one today.